I actually came to Miami because I wanted to study with Kim Josephson, mm -hmm. um, whom I met in, um, in Italy when I did Separ la Sicanta. And he was one of the teachers there. And he's one that I just, whose teaching practice resonated with me. And he was teaching at the University of Oklahoma at the time. And so that is where, um, that's the only <laughs> graduate school initially I applied to, the University of Oklahoma, because I was just, I wanted to study with him. I think I often say I'm um, stupid in that way, that when I see something that I really want, I set my focus on that thing and that thing only. And so I wasn't interested in any other graduate school because I wanted to study with this one um, teacher. And I didn't bother to, to learn about any others, which in hindsight was not a very smart decision. But luckily I went there and I sang and I won the, the competition, the scholarship competition, and the next morning he tells me, you know, my, I might be getting an, you know, an offer down at the University of Miami. And, um, and so we drafted an email together. This was two months later, you know, past the deadline for application. And so we drafted an email, sent it to them, and, and said, I'm this baritone, and I'd love to, you know, um, audition for you if, you if you're interested. And he, had, he, he didn't have the job at the time, but because I, I decided, no, I, I want to study with you, I will follow you anyway. And I'm so glad that I followed him here to the University of Miami because I had an incredible, incredible three years. But yeah, so initially I went, I came here to study with, with Kim Josephson and then I discovered, um, you know, what was an incredible institution for my development as a singer. <laughs>